Artist Gallery was founded in 1998 and is a bit rare in the sense that it's a cooperative gallery ran by the artists who display their work there. Its roughly 40 members take turns managing the gallery during hours of operation and other duties to keep the place looking beautiful. I think it's very important to have this gallery because we feature local artists unlike virtually every other gallery in the area and it gives all of us member artists an opportunity to exhibit our work, to hopefully sell our work, and to interact with the public because we all have to work here. We all are very involved and, and knowledgeable about the work so we can assist the public. Um, oftentimes people will come in, they'll look, they'll commingle with the artists, commingle with their friends who are in the gallery, and then they'll come back another time and buy something that caught their eye. Co-ops are kind of unusual these days. Um, when the gallery was first formed over 16 years ago, the Wisconsin Arts Board consultants said, well, you know, the average life of a cooperative gallery is yeah, maybe three years, and we're 16 years later and we're still going strong. Oh, I think it's very important, particularly when we have as vibrant an art community as we do in Racine. A lot of it, it kind of is behind or beneath the surface lots of times, but really compared to other cities, its size and even compared with many larger cities, our know, Racine's arts community is very large, very involved, very productive. And it's great to be able to get work out so the public can see what their friends and neighbors are doing.